it comes to pests in the high tunnel, there's a number of examples that you might see. Some of the beetles, for instance, that you might have on certain crops would be your Japanese beetles or your striped cucumber beetles or even your squash bugs. Uh, this here is an example of okra, which isn't commonly seen in a high tunnel, but the Japanese beetles love it. And basically what they will do is chomp these leaves here, which is destructive to the plant and also cosmetic issue. Um, some of the measures for dealing with Japanese beetles would be removal with your hands, using a small vacuum cleaner to suck them off. And of course, there always are going to be sprays that can be used as deterrents. When it comes to pests in the cucurbit family, which includes your cucumbers and squashes, uh, there can be some pretty uh, annoying ones, such as the striped cucumber beetle and the squash bug. The striped cucumber beetle, it is uh, unique in that it has a bacteria in its gut that when it bites or um, defecates on the leaf, it will actually infect the leaf and uh, cause this bacterium wilt that you can see here. Typically, you will see some aphids here and there on plants, and usually they're not a huge concern, but sometimes you can get a huge overproduction of aphids if the plants are stressed or if the conditions aren't right. Uh, one of the best measures is the beneficial insects that will eat them, such as lady beetles. And you will see them in the high tunnel, and it's important to recognize what they are and what they look like, especially when they're in their immature stages, so you don't um, unnecessarily kill them. Within the brassica family, which includes your broccolis, kales, cabbages, the most common problem are the cabbage moths. And they're a white moth that flutter around and they will lay their eggs. And usually they'll lay the eggs either on the top side or the underside of the leaf. Then they will hatch and there'll be a green caterpillar that will chew holes onto your leaf. They're not as much of an issue um, for the health of the plant, but for cosmetic reasons, they are very cumbersome and, nu and a nuisance.